they're going to draw strawberries. Yes, we're going to draw a strawberry shortcake, right? Yeah. Yes. All right, Hats, you got your marker? Yeah. We hope you guys are going to follow along with us. We're going to keep uh, Strawberry Shortcake, this drawing, we're going to keep it nice and simple. So it's a little easier for younger artists. Is that cool? Mm -hmm. Okay. You know, you like Strawberry Shortcake? Yeah. She's pretty cute, huh? She's mm -hmm. got a big strawberry on her head. Yeah. <laughs> you ready to start? Yes. Okay, Hats, we're going to start with our paper vertical so that we can draw her standing up. She's going to be really tall, okay? And then we're going to start with her eyes. So we're going to do two uh, U-shapes that are upside down U-shapes, okay? So we're going to do one over here. So we'll draw a little U like this. Okay. You can draw it kind of off to the left a little. Yep, there you go. And you can maybe a little to more towards the middle. There we go. A little upside down U or a rainbow line. Yes, good job. And this is going to be the top of her eye. And then we're going to do another one on this side over here. And we want it to be about the same size. So you can leave a little space and then do another one right there. Okay. Good job. Awesome. Okay, now we can do the bottom and we'll connect the bottom like this with a shorter, with a not as curved of a line. It's kind of straight. And what do they look like? Gumdrops? Um. Yeah. <laughs> they look like cute little gumdrops, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay, and then we're going to draw, we can draw a um, curved line on the inside, on the left side of her eye. And this is going to be her pupil, okay? So it's kind of a little hook, hook line. There we go. Good job. She's going to look like she's looking to the left. Awesome. Okay, now on the inside of that, let's do a little circle. Like that, and we're gonna color everything in except for that little circle, okay? Okay. Perfect, okay, now let's draw her little nose. We'll draw a little nose right here in between her eyes. <laughs> Good, and that's kind of a backward C, huh? Mm -hmm. And then let's draw her mouth. So draw a little curved line like this, smiling, perfect. And then we can draw another little one right here in between, so kind of in the middle of that smile. And that's going to be her mouth. <laughs> Good job, Hads. <laughs> okay, now let's draw the bottom of her hat. So we're going to draw a big curved line at the top. So we're going to go over her eyes like this. We're gonna draw, it's gonna be pretty big because she has a lot of hair and she has a big hat. So I kinda of picked, I picked my marker up a couple times so we can go back over and smooth that out. There we go. So we're gonna draw a big curved line that goes over the top of her head. So we can start over here and then we can come all the way over here. Cause she has that big strawberry hat on her, on her head, huh? Mm -hmm. Good job. Awesome. Good. Okay, now let's do a little line that goes up on both sides. Okay. And then I'm going to turn my paper this way so I can do that curved line again. So I'm going to do another line that goes along the top and then connects to the other side. There we go, good job, that looks awesome. Okay, now let's draw the brim of her hat, okay? That's the part of her hat that sticks out or the visor of her hat. So we'll do a little cur curl that comes out over here, not too far, and I'm just gonna go to the edge over there. Good job. And then I'm gonna curl around and then we're gonna come back in like that. So we can draw from there Right there, we can draw and connect to there. Perfect, good job. You know what, I forgot. Let's let's go back to her eyes and we can do little eyelashes, okay? okay. Should we do a little eyelash right here on this side and a little eyelash on this side? Two little eyelashes. Okay. Good job, good job. And then two on that side, perfect. And then we can also do 
a little eyebrow over her eye on that one, on her left eye. Awesome. Okay, now let's put a little curl on the side of her head, okay? So we'll do a line that comes down and it's going to just curl around like that. So we can start right here and then come down and then hook back up to that line or that point. Good. Oh, it's very curly. I like it. Are you having fun? Yeah. Good. <laughs> okay, I'm going to draw another curl that comes around like that and then connects into that. So we can start right here and then curl into that point. Good job, Hads. Okay, let's finish her face. So we're going to draw her chin and her, her cheek too. So we're going to, let's start over here. So we're going to come down and come down like this. Okay, and we'll draw a little line that comes down and it's going to come down to her chin down here. So it's a little curve like this. Yes, good job. Okay, and then we're going to draw another line that comes over here for this side of her face and then curls into her little chin like that. So we start right over here and then connect into her chin. You did it. Okay, and she has little freckles and we're going to color those later, okay? Okay. All right, so let's finish her hair. So we can put a little, let's put a little... It's kind of like a wave line, a wavy line. And you can draw it right here under her visor. Little piece of hair that's sticking out. Perfect. Kind of looks like a wave. I was thinking of like this, of the wave on the ocean. <laughs> All right. Okay, now we could do another wave that kind of comes out over here on this side, coming out over her visor right here. Good job. Should we do her hat next? Yeah. All right. This is the cool part. We're going to start up here and we're going to do a big, a big kind of curve rainbow line that comes out over and it's really big and then it comes back into her hat right there. So we can start right here, draw a big curve and goes right into her hat. Yes. Good job. Okay, then we're gonna come back over here. We're gonna do the other side. So we're gonna come around, curve around. Looks like a big, the top of a strawberry, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we start right here and then curve around and then end right there. Perfect. Okay, and then let's draw the leaf that's coming out of her hat. So draw a little curve, come right there. Yes, and then it can kind of curve a little bit more in, maybe into a point like right there. Perfect. Okay, then we're going to do a bigger curve like that. Good job. Give me five. We did it. Okay, let's do the little seeds that are on her hat. So the little ovals. We can do a couple ovals. Let's do them. Let's do them about that size, and we can do three on this side over here. Good. Another one. And we can do two over on this side. <laughs> and we could do two more. Let's do one right here in the middle, and then another one up here. So you can do one like right there, and then another one right there. Perfect. Okay, now let's do her body and then we'll do her hair last, okay? Kay. Her really pretty hair. All right, so let's do two lines that come out for her neck, right at the bottom of her chin. Good job. And then we can connect those with a little curve for the start of her t-shirt. Good. And then we're going to come out for her shoulders. So two little lines that come out for her shoulders on both sides. Good. Okay, now we're gonna do her dress. So we're gonna do a line that comes down and then curves out. Down. Good. She's gonna have a really teeny little body. I like it. It's gonna be super cute. Okay, now we're gonna do the same thing on the other side, but curve the other direction. So curve out the other direction. Perfect. That looks so good. Okay, and then let's draw a curve line right here for her t-shirt. And then that's where her dress starts. 
Good job. Okay, now let's draw the bottom of her dress. And then we're going to do little U's that are connected. Like that. Okay. Is that fun? Mm -hmm. It looks really pretty, huh? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're doing such a good job. I like it. Okay, and then we can do, we're going to do little dots on her dress, but we'll color those with red, okay? Yeah. Later. All right, so now let's do, should we do her arms or should we do her legs next? What do you want to do? Mm, arms. <laughs> arms? Okay. So we're going to draw a little circle that comes out on the side right here, a little C shape on this side and a C shape on this side, and that's for her sleeves. Okay, so a little C right there and a little C on this side. Good. Good job. Okay, so now let's do her arms, okay? So we're gonna draw a line that comes out like this and another line that comes out next to it. You can draw two lines that come out on that side. Good. And then let's draw two lines that come out on this side. And we want them to be about the same length and about the same size, like that. Good, and then one more. Good job, and we did make them a little skinny, uh, skinnier at the top and then further apart at the bottom so they look like cartoon arms, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, let's draw our hands. We could just draw really simple hands. Let's draw a, a thumb, like that. Kind of like what we did for La La Loopsie. Do you remember that La La Loopsie doll? Yeah. That was fun, huh? Mm -hmm. So we draw a thumb on this side too, on both sides. And then let's just draw a U shape for the rest of her hand, like that. And then that makes it a lot easier, huh? And if our art friends want to, they can draw little fingers. Good job. She looks super cute. Let's draw her legs next. Okay. You ready? Uh -huh. Okay. We're gonna draw. We're gonna do the same thing that we kind of did for her arms. We're just gonna draw two uh, lines that come out like this for her legs. And we're gonna draw them kind of, I'm drawing them a lot longer, huh? Mm -hmm. A little bit bigger. Good. And then we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. So we draw two lines over here for her other leg, too. Perfect. Okay, and then let's draw a big loop at the bottom or a U shape at the bottom for her shoe on this side and on this side. Squeaky markers. <laughs> Good job. You did it, Hads. Okay, let's draw our shoes. We're going to draw a little uh, U shape, a little curve on this side, and a curve on this side. So we could draw a little curve right here, and a little curve right there for the top of her shoe. Good job. And then we could put a little, another little curve inside, like that. It's almost like a football shape. Yeah. Like that. And you can do that on both sides. Yes. Good job. Okay, we're going to leave her socks. Uh, we're going to color her socks later with green, with the green stripes, okay? Okay, let's finish her hair. We're almost done. So let's do a little curl up here at the top, coming out of her hat, right there. So we make her, we're going to make her hair really pretty. Good, that looks, that looks cute. <laughs> All right, okay, now we're gonna draw a big curve that comes down like this, okay? So we draw a curve that comes out of that and comes down to there. Yes, oh, and you even made it an S curve, which is perfect because that's what I was gonna do too. <laughs> I'm gonna make a little S curve or a little, see how it S's back around just like you? You could hook and put a little hook that comes up, finishes, so it looks a little curly at the end. Okay, and then we're gonna come back, like that. Okay, and then let's do another one that comes out a little further. Perfect, you know what? Let, or let's do one more and we'll connect it into her hand. And you could just connect that one right into her hand. Good, and then let's, I'm gonna imagine this coming through her arm. We're gonna do another one back in here. It's gonna go behind her body. You see that? So 
So let's just do another curve right here that connects her hand to her dress. Perfect, yes, just like that. Okay, now let's do the other side, okay? So we're gonna do another curve that comes out over here like this. And I'm gonna stop right there, but we're gonna do another S, kind of like what you did on the other side. So we're gonna start there, curve down to here. Right there. Yes, good job. And then right at the end, let's do a little hook, like, it, like on the other side. Okay, and then let's curl back. And I curled into her hand, and if you could probably curl right to there. Awesome. And then I'm gonna do I'm gonna do a little curl back and then back in. Let's see where you at. And then you could curl back out too, right to there. Is this fun? Mm -hmm. It's looking really pretty, huh? Yeah. And then let's curl that line all the way into her dress. And I'm gonna do the same thing. Heads, you did awesome. Give me five. Did you have fun? Yeah. You promise? Yeah. Okay, we're not done yet though. What do we gotta do? Uh, color her. Yes. Should we get our colors all picked out? Yeah. Okay. We're gonna use uh, just these colors. We're using oil pastels from Pentel. And uh, if our art friends don't have uh, this set, they can just use crayons or markers, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're gonna use a kind of a slight peach, a darker peach. And we got a light pink and a dark pink and a green. And that's it. That's all we're gonna use. Sound like fun? Yeah. All right, we're gonna fast forward the whole thing because uh, we're not gonna do any shading. So our friends at the end can pause it and then match what we did, okay? Okay. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. Let's do it right yeah. now. <laughs> Heads, you did it! We finished her! She looks super cute! Did you have fun? Yeah. What was your favorite part? Um, her hair. Her hair? That was my favorite part too because it looks so pretty, huh? Mm -hmm. Yes. And it's okay that our that our drawings look a little bit different, huh? Yeah. Yeah, it's not important that they look perfect, right? Mm -hmm. No, because what's the most important thing? Having fun. Yes, having fun. <laughs> Yes, having fun is definitely the most important thing when you're doing art. Remember that your drawings don't have to look just like ours either, right? Yeah, tell them it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> we, <laughs> we hope you guys had fun and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Bye.